Hello everyone, this is Firoz Mohammed from Magnetus Technologies. So in this video series on Microsoft Dynamics 365 customer engagement, I'm just going to walk you through how we can install the sample data on your Dynamics 365 environment. Many a times when you're trying to configure your sandbox or production instance, you will need some sample data over there. At least when you're configuring your production environment, you will need sample data to test the environment. And once you have done configuring your environment, you would need to uninstall that sample data. So in this video, we are going to see how we can install as well as uninstall the sample data on your production environment. So here I have the production environment I have as part of the partnership I have with Microsoft. So as you can see that I don't have any data here at all. Even if I look at my uh, dashboard, I don't see any data here. So I just need to install the data first. So let me just navigate to settings, go to data management settings, then navigate to sample data. So I can see an option over here to install the sample data. Just click install sample data. Normally it won't take a lot of time, it will take a few seconds or hardly a minute to install the data. So once it is installed, then you will be able to access the data. So let's install first. Well, let's see if the sample data is installed. I can just navigate to sales and then dashboards. Yeah, now I'm able to see some data. That means the sample data is installed. To further check it, I can just go to sales and accounts. I'm able to see a set of account records are here. That means the sample data has been installed on my production environment. Now, if you want to uninstall it, same procedure. Just again, go to settings, data management, sample data. There you get an option to remove sample data. So this option is you mostly needed when you are just going to import your real data into your production environment once the testing has been done. So in that case, you can just remove the sample data. I hope this video was helpful and subscribe our channel for more videos.